Hi everyone, it's Hal, and today I'm going to talk to you about a munchkin on a, their biography. I'm going to do, it's one, this is called Olga Nardoni. She was one of the Lullaby League munchkins. She was a sleepyhead. Munchkins were on a town system in the Wizard of Oz in 1939. Let's begin. Olga Nardoni was born in Newton, Massachusetts on June 8th, 1921, making her exactly one year and two days older than Judy Garland herself. Her parents, Louise and Leonardo B. Nardoni, had other children, providing Olga with an extended family. Both an older and younger sister and younger brother, whom all of whom grew to be normal size. It, it was not only Olga's lack of stature that marketed her for an early stage career, the little girl definitely possessed multi-talents. Easily recognized and encouraged by her mother and father and siblings, she could act, dance, ballet, tap, play the harmonica. Her stage names were eventually included Little Olga, Princess Olga, Tiny Olga. Yet, when the teenager's agent learned of MGM's interest for her, for the Wizard of Oz, Olga, by her own admission, had to be talked into. I did not want to go. My sister or Linda came with me because I told my family I wouldn't go unless she did. Also, along for the cross country journey to go over city was Olga's dancing teacher, Madrid Seiko who additionally accompanied the girl to the Oz set and would round up occasional coach for the entire Munchkin troop. Let's begin. Let's continue. Uh, for, fortunately for fans, Olga would be frequently visible in the movie as well as production steals and behind the scenes publicity photos that were taken during filming. She returned home to her home in Massachusetts immediately thereafter. However, we resumed her stage and vaudeville career. In the process, she had added a new routine to her act, a brief ballet sequence that presented Olga as a Corey Fee, dressed in her Wizard of Oz pink dress and shoes. She later wrote an MGM Studios chief of police, whom she made friends during the seven weeks of, weeks of Oz work. That new number was very popular with her audience. Olga passed away at her home in Newton, Massachusetts on September 24, 2010. She was 89 years old. So that is the story of Olga Nardoni. She was a munchkin in the Wizard of Oz. So let me see if I can pull up a picture of her. And I'll show you guys her. Can you, did you see that? That's the picture of her in the Wizard of Oz. Let me show you another picture of her. There. 
there so that was the con that was my biography reading of Olga Nardoni Munchkin thank you so much for watching have a nice day